Hi, I'm Shane Breen and I'm part of Horseport Ireland's high performance show jumping squad. I'd like to welcome you to my home in Hickstead here. Uh, myself and my team would like to show you some of the exercises we've been doing. So here we have Darcy on her 13-2 pony, myself on an 8-year-old horse, Jack on a 6-year-old, Georgia on a 5-year-old homebred, Shane on another 5-year-old, Emmy on her own horse, 8, and Kate on another 8-year-old. So this is one of my favourite exercises. It's quite simple. It's uh, four poles in a circle. Uh, to measure them out, you go from, make a cross, and you go from the centre of the first pole, direct line, to the other pole, and it's 10 yards. And the same to measure up the other side. Um, the first pony was my daughter, Darcy. The second one was Lorna, two ponies. They could go around on four strides or three strides. And this is Katie doing it on three strides. The beauty of this exercise, I think, is... It gets horses quite supple. It gets them around your inside leg and it gets you to keep your contact with your outside hand so that to make your distance on the three strides, center, 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 you have to use leg, you have to, your own core, your shoulders have to be back. And um, also the horses come more supple in their body, in their rib cage and a nicer contact to the mouth. And if you want to go it in two strides, you can do that also. So this next exercise is one of my favorites. It's a canter pole, three yards to a bounce, cross pole, cross pole, cross pole. I like to put it three yards and a foot between each of the crosses. And then six yards to the vertical with a canter pole at the back. And another six yards to a vertical, canter pole at the back. And then with V's on it, and then another six yards to V's on an oxer. And I find this exercise is very good for the horses, relaxes them, gets them very confident jumping combinations and lines of fences. And also, you know, we're putting emphasis on the horse, but for, as a rider, also our own position to keep our chin up, look ahead, shoulders back and lower leg position which is most important as when we were doing the other poles it's all about your lower leg so this is a head-on of the exercise as you see the canter pole the three cross poles fence and then the other two fences with v-poles on them the idea of the exercise for me is straightness as well as getting the horse's suppleness over the fence and if we look here in a straight on angle at everybody coming through it the cross poles immediately help straighten up the horse and then you have the v's that should help and if a horse drifts slightly one way or the other we can also put poles on the ground after the fence just as like a tunnel for them to go through but normally it should fix itself once they've been through it once or twice if your position is good looking up looking ahead the horses should go through nice and straight Concentrate on your position, concentrate on the smoothness. And here, if you'd like to come through it with me, this is what we've been doing. And there's no need to jump big. Small is plenty. Those fences are only 90 centimeters. So it's very nice to hack back up from being down on the showgrounds in the polo arena. Um, it's nice for the horses to chill out and have a hack back up. And um, my horse is a bit more chill than the ponies. Here's Siobhan. I'm very fortunate with the team that I have here at Breen Equestrian. Without them, I'd be lost. Would you like to see some of the horses? This is Ipswich here. So Ipswich has been having a little bit of a quiet time. Uh, he goes in the field every day. Uh, he's been doing uh, flat work. And I like to give him a few little jumps there on Thursday. Just like what we did today, very small. And, um, so he's enjoying quite time, uh, compelling as well. Uh, he's on the same routine, and um, yeah, I think they're quite enjoying it in the holiday. And um, yeah, so this is the park over here. Um, 
And I know this has been a very difficult time for everybody, but I think stay at home, stay safe, we'll get through this together, and we'll very soon be back at shows competing.